We're here in the uh, SIG World Home Workshop to talk about welding electrodes. Um, welding electrodes are still used, or stick electrodes are still used a lot in today's marketplace. Uh, they're great for on-site work. They're great for doing the odd job around the home. Um, so yeah, they're a fantastic thing to have. But for those who are new to stick welding, you need to know there's different types of, of these welding electrodes. So the basic types are general purpose electrodes and they're called rutile electrodes. And there's two main types. There's a 13 series and a 12 series. The 12 series means that you can weld in all positions. And that means downhand, flat, vertical up, overhead, and horizontal, or vertical down. A 13 series electrode, you can do all those, but you can't weld vertical down. That's the difference. We also have another aspect to it all, and that is we have, in the Sigwell range, we have two series of electrodes. We have the blue professional series electrodes, and we have the Sigwell weld skill electrodes. The professional series electrodes are made with more expensive Componentry in the flux coating um, compared to the well skill electrodes. Still very good, easy to use electrodes, the well skill electrodes, uh, but a little bit more budget conscious. Additionally, to general purpose electrodes, 12s and 13s, you then step up into iron powder electrodes. So, what, what they do is they put iron filings basically or iron powder into the coating of the electrode, and that allows you to get a longer weld out of the same length electrode. From iron powder electrodes, you step up into low hydrogen electrodes or hydrogen controlled electrodes. And what they are, they are a higher strength electrode. So if you're welding something like a dozer bucket or some plant and machinery that requires high strength, then you normally go to low hydrogen electrodes. And there's two main types, and they're called the 16 series and the 18 series in low hydrogens. The 16s are more designed for uh, specialised pipe welding, uh, structural steel. Uh, the 18 series electrode, again, has got a small amount of iron powder in it, in the coating, um, and allows you to get longer welds. From there, there are other higher strength electrodes, um, but there's also electrodes for welding stainless steel. So the beauty about welding with a stick welding machine is that you can have one machine and multiple packets of electrodes and nearly do anything. So... Stainless steel electrodes available in 309 grade, 316, which is probably the most popular grade for stainless steel, 308 grade as well. And there's bronze electrodes available for welding up bronze. There's cast iron electrodes. And there's an electrode that's proprietary to Sigweld called Weldall. Now, Weldall is very similar to what the name suggests. It welds nearly anything. The only thing it doesn't weld is aluminium. Okay. So it welds steel to stainless steel, steel to spring steel, steel to unknown steels. What Weldall isn't really designed for is welding cast iron. And in, in the Sigwell range, you use a product called Castcraft to weld cast iron. So that's a little bit of a summary on our Sigwell electrode range.